earlier, I went in search of perfectly straight green beans and found my harvesting skills weren't quite up to scratch. This is saying you're you big in the, the magic bullet. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, that is me all over. How many kgs of waste a week, would you say? Waste alone can be as far as a ton. One ton a week? Wow. Some supermarkets have stopped topping and tailing veg. But, of course, there's still a lot of waste, not to mention all the bendy ones. What happens, then, to the really bend beans? Like, I mean, look at that one. That's all over the... Whoop, that's all over the place. <laughs> we preserve them for our very special plants, which we can go and I show you where they are. I see. Yeah. Now, I want to find out what happens to the unwanted bendy beans. And Peter says he has a special client who uses every last bit. These must be very special customers. Very special customers, indeed. And we give them very special attention. You've left the sunroof off. Heads up, let's go. Yeah. I can't see anything yet. No landfill or colossal compost heap. So I don't know where we're going, but it's the most amazing vehicle. Oh, a little bit bumpy. Should be all right. It's a good way to get to work in the morning, isn't it? The baboons, they're your special clients. Baboons. Special clients, indeed. Wow. So special, the company's made them their own purpose-built baboon playground. It's the worst that can happen. We get stuck in this quagmire. Don't, Just don't get stuck in here, yeah? You're stuck. We are stuck in the mud. Yeah, I mean, they've all sort of tuned in on the fact that we're stuck. These baboons are vegetarians, aren't they? So I think what might happen is we might turn into the lunch. Mm. Ah, there we go. Not worried in the slightest, by the way. Yes, you buddy. It's, uh, I just relied on my food unwrapped training. That just kicked in. Phew, we could have ended up as today's special. But thankfully, Bendy beans are best on the menu. All our bendy beans come to them. Is it just a nice thing to do to feed the wildlife, or do you get any benefit from feeding them these beans? It's a win-win situation because they could invade our farms. Right. So, so we made a, a decision as a, a company to ensure we put them on in one place they can feed. Well, if this mob turned up, they'd strip yeah. your beans. You'd, you wouldn't have straight beans or bendy beans. They are not our enemies, but we need to find a harmonised way of living together with them. Right. The baboons play their part in providing straight beans to the supermarket. Okay.